Hi everyone. In this brief tutorial I'm going to show you how to set up pagination or page numbering so that it follows the template guidelines for your research report. As you know the guidelines are quite specific in that you have to have Roman numerals for your preliminary pages and from the introduction onwards you use Arabic or regular numbers beginning on page 1 for the introduction. The title page, although it assumes the Roman num number I, does not have a page number on it. And we're going to do this in Word 2010 and there are some quirks so I'm going to talk you through how to set it up as easily as possible. I've created a document with four pages to start with and these would be typical preliminary pages in a document. So they are your title page, abstract, acknowledgements and table of contents. And we're going to begin by inserting page numbers for these. So we go to the insert menu, click on page number and we're going to firstly format the page numbers. You can also format the page numbers after you've inserted them by right clicking. But we'll click on format page numbers and we want to change the number format to Roman numerals and we will start at I for the first Roman numeral and click on OK. So that doesn't actually insert the page numbers, it just sets up the formatting. So to insert them we again click on page number and we select where we're going to position the page number. I'm going to position mine at the bottom centre of the page so I'll select that option and that inserts numbers on each page. So far so good but as you remember we don't want to have a number on the first page. So we, when we inserted the page numbers we get this header and footer tools menu which opens in uh, Microsoft Word and we're going to click on different first page uh, to check that checkbox and that changes the pagination so that there's no number on the title page and there are numbers then on abstract, acknowledgements, table of contents and so on. So the second thing that we're going to do is insert a section break to create a new section from the introduction onwards and we need to do that to ensure that we can number that section differently to the preliminary page. So I want to put my section break after my table of contents. So I click where I want to insert the section break and to set it up I go to page layout, click on breaks and this menu tells me the different types of breaks that I can insert. So we're inserting a break where the we start the new section on the next page. If you had already typed your title you could select continuous to start a new section on this page but we're going to select next page. So now we have a new page and you'll see if you scroll down that we have no page number on this page. So um, we can begin by typing the title of the page. We'll call it introduction and we're going to insert page numbers again. So we go to the insert menu and click on page number and we're going to format these page numbers so that they use Arabic numbers and we're not continuing from the previous section so we click on start at 1 and when we do that I need to then go to page number bottom of page and select uh, the center which is where I want to place position this page number. So I've now inserted the page number and you can see that it's Arabic numbering but I don't need a different first page for this section to the other page numbers uh, to the other numbers that follow on from it so I'm going to uncheck the different first page checkbox. Now a quirk of Word 2010 is that once we insert the page numbers for the new section um, when we look back at our page numbers it has reinserted the Roman numeral 1 on the title page. So just make sure when you click uh, into the Roman numeral 1 that different first page is 
checked for this section and we'll just delete uh, that by pressing the backspace or delete button and we now have no number on the title page but we have numbers on the abstract, acknowledgements and table of contents all of which are Roman numerals and then the first page of our introduction uses Arabic numbering and that will continue throughout. I hope this is helpful when you go to set up your page numbering for your reports.